When the show aired its UK season finale back in November, Irene had just been placed under arrest by Rose for hindering a police investigation, in full view of all the customers in the pier diner. Irene had been living in fear ever since learning that she could face charges for helping Dana evade the authorities, whilst she was on the run from corrupt copper Will Madden. Even though Irene only knew that Dana was hiding out in her house for a matter of hours, after new lodger Harper snuck her sister into her room shortly before Irene went away for a couple of weeks, there was always the possibility that the police were going to try and make an example of her, even after clearing Dana of all charges. As we pick up the action in the new year, Irene is marched down to Yabby Creek Police Station for questioning whilst John desperately tries to track down Cash, but he's been called into an anti-corruption meeting in the city. Irene is fuming at Rose, not only for arresting her in her workplace in front of everyone, but also for her previous assurance that she'd most likely be fine. Rose can only apologize and say that things had changed. Harper also isn't getting off scot-free, as she finds when she's also arrested on the beach in front of Dana. On arrival at the police station, and seeing Irene also present, Dana sounds off at Rose telling her that she knows this is wrong, but Harper tells her to cool it before she's thrown out. As Irene heads into the interview room, John lays the blame firmly down on Harper and Dana for the mess they've put her in. Meanwhile, Rose interrogates Irene on why she didn't call the police as soon as she realized Dana was there. Irene is unrepentant however, telling her that she believed Dana's story. Come on Rose, you know me, an exasperated Irene tells her. Do you really think I would have broken the flippin' law without a damn good reason? Next up is Harper. And as she faces Rose's questions in the interview room, Dana apologizes to Irene. Irene assures her that she went into this with her eyes open, and doesn't regret it for a single minute. Irene and Harper later have their mugshots and fingerprints taken, but when Rose contacts the magistrate she's forced to deliver some bad news. They can't be seen until morning, and with the sergeant refusing to grant the pair bail, they'll be forced to stay in the cells overnight. When Cash finally returns, John catches up with him and the two head back down to the station. Cash is met with a frosty reception from his colleagues though, following his meeting in the city, he's been officially suspended from the force for three months. Irene doesn't think it's a coincidence that the police pounced on her and Harper as soon as Cash was out of the way, and Cash agrees. Something about this stinks, and if this is the way the force is heading, then he's not even sure he wants to be a part of it anymore. Elsewhere in Summer Bay Tane is on top of the world after wife Felicity agreed to start a family with him. Despite Flick making her position on not wanting children clear in the early stages of their relationship, Tane had been hoping that Flick would one day change her mind, just as she eventually did with the idea of marriage. When Flick told Tane that her position hadn't changed, it was clear to her that Tane was struggling with his disappointment. Despite his assurances otherwise, Flick worried that Tane burying his true feelings could eventually become a deal-breaker in their marriage, and so suggested in the UK's 2023 finale week that they should indeed try for a baby. Next week, there's only one thing on Tane's mind, and that's procreation. As the two rush home after Tane finishes up a gym session, Tane is already talking about turning Nikau's old room into the nursery. Flick is quick to point out that she's only just come off the pill so he needs to be patient. That doesn't stop Tane immediately wanting to go for round two though, after a brief interlude which sees Cash come home to find his sister in the front room in only her robe. When the pair eventually drag themselves to Salt, Flick tells Cash that they're now trying for a baby and Cash is stoked for them. He does however wonder about the sudden turnaround. Flick tries to place the credit onto Cash after his pep talk but he remains slightly dubious. With Cash having touched a nerve, Flick just asks him to be happy for them. But it soon transpires that Flick is not being honest with Tane. Once he's out the way, Flick heads into Salt's storeroom where she has her box of contraceptive pills hidden away. And proceeds to take one. 